हेलो फ्रेंड्स आई एम संजय गुप्ता इन दिस वीडियो आई एम गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट इंटरव्यू क्वेश्चन रिलेटेड टू सी प्लस प्लस सो दीज आर माई इन्फॉर्मेशन यू कैन यूज दीज इन्फॉर्मेशन फॉर योर स्टडी पर्पजेस इट इंक्लूड माई ऐप बुक्स एंड यूट्यूब चैनल नाउ फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन इज वॉट इज एब्सट्रैक्ट क्लास आंसर इज इट इज ऑल्सो कॉल्ड एन एब्सट्रैक्ट सुपर क्लास एन ऑब्जेक्ट टेक्नोलॉजी इट इज अ क्लास क्रिएटेड एज अ मास्टर स्ट्रक्चर no objects of an abstract class are created rather sub classes of the abstract class are defined with their own variations and the sub classes are used to create the actual objects next question what is abstraction answer is in object terminology determining determining the essential characteristics of an object abstraction is one of the basic principle of object oriented design which allows for creating user defined data types known as objects next question is what is base class in uh, inheritance a prime feature of object oriented programming can be stated as the process of creating new classes called derived classes from the existing class existing classes which are called base classes so in case of inheritance the existing classes are known as base classes with the help of them you can create new classes the derived class inherits all the capabilities of the base class and can add refinements and extensions of its own the base class remains unchanged what do you mean by class so answer is the object with the same data structures which are known as attributes and behaviors which are known as operations are grouped into a class up all those objects possessing similar properties are grouped into the same unit next question is what is class object answer is a class specification only declares the structure of object and it must be instantiated in order to make use of the services provided to it this process of creating objects of the class is called class instantiation next question is what is constructor answer is a constructor is a special member function whose main operation is to allocate the required resources such as memory and initialize the objects of its class next question is what is constructor overloading answer is an inter interesting feature of the constructors is that a class can have multiple constructors that is called constructor overloading all the constructor have the same name as the corresponding class and they differ only in terms of their signature in terms of the number of arguments or data types of their arguments or both next question is what is copy constructor answer is a constructor having a reference to an instance of its own class as an argument is known as copy constructor next question is what is derived class answer is a derived class extends its features by inheriting the properties of another class which is called base class and adding feature of its own so derived class contains uh, features of base class as well as new features of its own the declarations of a derived class specifies its relationship with the base class in addition to its own features next question what is destructor so answer is when an object is no longer needed it can be destroyed so a class can have another special member function called the destructor which is invoked when an object is destroyed thank you for watching this Uh, video hope these question and answers will be beneficial for your placement purpose